The little girl in this picture has grown up quite a bit. But anytime your kid does something amazing, you know, I think there's a little bit of like, just wow. Doing something most adults will never. Just one of those things. 12 year old Kate Lyon says she isn't a hero. I would call her a heroine. <laughs> yes, absolutely. Her grandfather, Tom, who she calls Pops, says quite the opposite. I just, it was all such so foggy for so many days that slowly it started creeping in that I understood, you know, that she saved my life. You see, Kate was with her brother Jack at Grandma and Pop's house in Okemos for the 4th of July weekend. And we had dinner and my wife brought out some July, this was July 4th weekend, some festive cookies. Ooh. And we were in the process of selecting one. When the unthinkable happened. We just sort of kind of fell over slowly on the table. And Pops wasn't pulling her leg because we were joking around before that, so we just thought it was part of the joke. Kate was ready. Yeah, it's um, at the Forest Hills Community Center. A babysitting class paid off. So we signed her up just to, um, just to give her the skills. Well, I was shocked. I mean, I, uh, I didn't know she had taken the class. Just a few weeks prior, Kate learned a skill she'd never thought she'd need. CPR because I had forgotten about one like like the little tiny details that can help a lot like the how far you go down and what position your hands are in and where exactly to do it the 911 operator refreshing her memory I don't know I in situations that are stressful I think it actually helps me to be able to do something so being able to do that kind of helped me know that I was helping and not just like freezing and I just sort of wanted to help and do everything I could. Kate did more than everything she could. She did the only thing that doctors say could have saved Pops. Then I just kept doing them till the paramedics got there. Without her, there's almost no chance he'd be here. The little girl holding her grandpa's hand in this picture, handing Pops the chance for many more moments like this. I just did what I could. The message here is simple. If you're not CPR certified, you should certainly consider doing it. If a 12 year old can, you can too. This family is saying it's inspired all of them to get up to date on their CPR certifications. And if this helps just one other family, that's what they want. Reporting in Lansing, Julie Denmeyer, Fox 17 News.